an opposing team comes in here or we're on the road, we feel like we're going to get their best shot, uh, you know, despite their record. So I uh, just feel like we couldn't get control of the pace of the game tonight. Uh, they were crashing offensive glass, doing the little things tonight, which um, kept them in the game. So a few mistakes on our end uh, that I feel like we can clean up. I think uh, we talked about in the locker room, uh, you know, as a group, just watch film tomorrow, see where we can get better. These games are coming quick. So, you know, we'll take the win and, um, you know, see where we can learn. And then just this is the first time we're talking to you since you guys had LaMarcus Aldridge. Just what does he bring to the table? Uh, well, shoot, not only his IQ and his experience, um, which, which speaks for itself, but I think just the maturity of, of having a, a versatile piece like that, being able to post up, slow the game down, uh, you know, be able to throw it into him and, and just let him work. Uh, we got a few guys that, uh, you know, were pretty much the focal points of their teams that, that they came from. Uh, so coming here, we, we just need them to be themselves, uh, make the high level plays that they've been doing over the course of their career. And, and now we just set a higher standard for ourselves um, as we collectively, um, you know, get this thing going before the end of May or the middle of May. Greg Logan with Newsday. Uh, Kyrie, do you have any worries at all because so many guys have missed so much time uh, that it's going to be hard to blend everybody back in or will just the talent level be so fantastic that it, you think it'll be easy to get it clicking? Uh, well, I mean, my, you know, <laughs> I think we have a, a unwavering belief in one another in terms of the talent that we have on um, as a group. So, it, you know, I, I don't think that uh, we feel like if any one guy is out of the lineup or two guys out of the lineup that we don't have a great chance of winning. But when we get to the time where we're fully healthy, uh, I think, um, you know, it'd be a, a, an interesting sight, sight to see, uh, you know, f not only for ourselves, but for other teams. And, and we can actually, um, you know, kind of develop some continuity from that in, in terms of uh, the lineups and, and different guys playing together, and we can just cement something that we have going into the playoffs. Um, but it's day by day; anything could happen. Uh, and you know, in this league, we just got to prepare for circumstances that we don't have control over, or sometimes they come up. So, just got to be able to move on to the next thing. Um, you know, everybody in this league likes likes to say "next game, next man up" mentality, "next person up" mentality. But that that's to the truest sense in terms of how many games we're playing in a short amount of time. So just implement guys that are new um, as quickly as we can and, and go from there as mature, uh, you know, players out here. Malika Andrews with ESPN. Hi, Kyrie. Uh, welcome back. James Harden told us the other day that he doesn't feel that he simply belongs in the MVP conversation. He feels that he is the MVP. I'm wondering how you compliment him, support him, push him in that. Uh, well, well, first, he's self-motivated, which makes him great. Um, you know, you, you got to have some type of self-motivation to get yourself up for these games and consistently show up. He's done a great job all season for us being consistent um, and, and just, you know, kind of leading our team, um, whether I'm in the, out of the lineup or Kay's out of the lineup, um, you know, our different guys are, are, are playing with him. He's been able to, to adjust and adapt uh, quickly. And when you throw some great pieces around a great player that's able to play point guard out there and just kind of be who he is, it you know it, it's our job out there to be responsible for our roles, play it at a high level, then compliment him and vice versa. Uh, so, you know, we support him and it's a team effort. It's team basketball out there. You know, our, our uh, record is a reflection of, of how great we are as a team. Um, but, you know, in this league, individuals are very special and you got to give credit when credit is due. So us, us as a team, we just want to continue to support them.